Max, how pleased are you today with the goal and the three points? Uh, yeah, just buzzing to have the three points really. Uh, goal's a bonus, but the main thing's the three points. And yeah. just talk us through that goal you first in Rochdale Colours. Uh, yeah, great feeling obviously. And as a centre back, anything you can do to contribute going forward um, is great. You know, the main focus is keeping it solid at the back, but if you can contribute something, it's a great feeling. You mentioned the main focus keeping it solid at the back at 2 1. You know, the lads really defended well as a defensive unit, didn't we, to, to keep me off hands at bay? Yeah, I think in every game, um, especially on the first few games that I've played in this league, it seems like you've got to ride a wave at times where you've got to dig in and defend for certain parts of the game because you're not always going to have it 100% your way, uh, which is still something I'm getting used to and a few of the other lads uh, that have come in are uh, getting used to doing is getting through periods of the game where you, ha where you don't have the ball and you've got to dig in and defend properly. You've started every game so far this season. How are you enjoying being part of the uh, the first first eleven? Yeah, I'm loving every minute of it. I've just um, I've just got to stay uh, playing well, staying fit, and got to try and keep my shirt and uh, stay in that starting eleven. And the first win for the lads as well. That must give us a lot of confidence, now. Yeah, I mean, we the way we were playing, we always thought it was going to turn and. Uh, We've had meetings and stuff to keep the trust in the process and believe in what we're doing because we know we're a good enough team. Um, and the start and the results may not reflect, but at the end of the day, um, results are what matters. So uh, it's a great feeling to be off the mark now with the three points and lads can uh, crack on now and get a few more. And do you just describe the feeling at the end when all the players go over to the travelling supporters as well? Yeah, it's amazing. You know, you hear them in periods of the game and it does give you that boost. You know, it's true what people say about. 12th man you know when you when you get that roar it doesn't matter how you feel and you're going to run and you're going to give it all um, and it's a great feeling for them you know coming all this way and being able to thank them for coming and support and watching us win so how have you found it this season with the supporters back in grounds and it must be a real feeling amongst the crowd you know that buzz to be back and it must be great for the players as well yeah it's brilliant i think every single one of us said like after the first game like it's, it's amazing uh, for me personally i've not played in front of um, fans, you know, consistently. I've had the odd game in front of fans, but having it consistently, it's a great feeling. Great feeling, and the great fans. So yeah, really enjoyed it. And there's the cup game on Tuesday at Shrewsbury Town now, and then Colchester on Friday night. This win must give us a, a good bounce going into those games. Yeah, we've just got to recover and uh, prepare right, do all we can to be ready for the next game because we can't think we can take our foot off the gas now, we've got to keep going cup or league and we've got to get want to win every single game.